fit. So I have this Nike worn out thing where I put my phone when I run. I have these Alpha Elite biker shorts. Don't really use them to bike, use them to run. But there we go. They're like pretty long length. Um, sometimes if it's really sunny outside, I like to roll them up. And then I have a Nike training sports bra. I kind of got oil on it already. Um, that wasn't there. And then a Cubs black hat with my hair tied like kind of like in the back. Okay. I also use my Beats headphones when I go on runs. Today I'm putting this spray oil protective on me for like a nice, you know, glistening, crispy, tan thing I'm going for. These are my running shoes for today. Zoom out lows, yes. Zoom out lows, they're really old, but they're pretty supportive when I run. Um, as you can see, they're pretty beat up, but I'm doing TikTok, so we're vlogging today. So I do mini TikToks, mini vlog TikToks, and today I actually decided to do a full on detailed vlog. So I just record like my fit habits, my food, my workouts, the shoes. All right, we got the shoes in there because I like to show my fit and then the sweet sweat. All right, I got. I will also show you how I put my sweet sweat on. All right, dude, this is like literally the behind the scenes of my TikTok. Like, if you follow me on my Instagram, I post there. On there too. I wish I worked with Sweet Sweat because the amount of videos that I do that Sweet Sweat's in is just crazy. I don't know. So I like to bring this down to get this. This just helps me sweat more, um, rises the temperature in my core, so I can sweat. Hubby, and then you guys will see like the aftermath, right? This is another Fit Girl Summer Vlog. So this is what I normally do. I mean, I do this in the winter too, just because it helps me sweat. But you know, if you have like a photo shoot or if you're gonna go to the pool or like a beach day and you kind of want to sweat out like any extra like water weight or sodium or any sort of toxins, you can go on a jog and we'll see how we'll look afterwards. Okay. Or you can go on the Stairmaster. You know what I'm saying? But I like to run outside because you get the best of both worlds. Some cardio and a tan, you know? I mean, I don't have anywhere to go, but I just like doing this to feel better about myself. Okay? Okay? So this is it. This is what we got going. Hope you guys like these kinds of vlogs. Hope it helps some people, you know? Because sometimes I'm like, people really don't care about this, but I don't know. Like, I don't know, do you guys care? All right, and then this is how I look at, this is how we're looking like. Do we look okay? Also, if you didn't notice, I have braces. That's why I have a fat lisp. So that's what we're looking like. I'll do a video on that too. I'm gonna go ahead and talk about my braces, my braces journey and everything like that. So stay tuned if that's something you would like to learn about or um, listen to me about talking about it. I just came back from my run. And walked, jog, almost died. All right. Ooh, got the 
muddy it gets. It gets a little crazy. is up human so hi i'm drinking my smoothie or my protein shake with collagen peptides and the salted caramel one up protein which is amazing amazing feeds your gains dude i'm sweating like anyways i'm gonna jump in the shower wash my body with cold water you know it's barely what time is it 12:36. We have a Brazilian wax appointment that I'm gonna go to soon, right after. And um, trying to think if I should record it for you guys, but I don't know. I'm very shy. Obviously, I'm not gonna show you my private parts, but like the process that I go to, it's really fast, and my waxing lady's awesome. But I'll probably just like chicken out and not do it. But that's where I'm headed to. I can also show you what I wear when I go get waxed. If you want loose clothing, something easy to take off. Um, and yeah. And also, I worked out before because you're not supposed to sweat after waxing. 24 hours, yeah, after. So no swimming, no sweating or working out or any type of thing for that nature. Because yeah, but that's it. That is all. Ooh, what's up, guys? I like how I looked in the car. I just look like a scary lady who does drugs. So I just want to reiterate that um, I got my wax done. She's like honestly the best waxing lady ever. If you have any questions or comments about her or the services that she does or the service she does on me, I'll leave them down below. But yeah, 1010 recommend getting waxed for fit girl summer, hot girl summer, whatever you want to call it. Throw away the razor, obviously use it for your legs and other areas. I say as in like your womanly areas, just drop it. Um, trust me, once you get waxed, you'll never go back. Unless you don't like pain. I mean, who likes pain but like, like literally can't tolerate pain? If you can't tolerate pain, you can take two ibuprofens. Why do I look like this? 30 minutes before your appointment, just push on through. She's really great and conversated, so she'll distract you a lot. Um, she's really fast, 20, 25 minutes tops. And yeah, totally recommend it for, you know, summer. I don't know, that's it. I just wanted to, to chat about it a little bit more because I didn't like the video in the car because I look like a hot mess, but yes. And right now I just finished editing um, pictures on my Instagram and I just posted it barely. So if you don't follow me, follow me on my Instagram. I'm on there every single day on stories with you guys posting workouts and whatnot. So give me a follow too. Right now I'm just gonna make some lunch, do a little bit of editing and then get ready to close at Nike. It's been a long day, but got this.
It is 4.02. I go into work at 5.15. So I have my lunch here. I went Mexican style on yes, so don't judge me. <laughs> I have scrambled eggs with guac underneath and tortillas. I have some beans and rice and some chips on the side. I have this lemon wedge because I'm going to pour it in here. Okay. And I'm going to have a bubbly, which is actually zero calories, but it's um, flavored blueberry pomegranate. It's sparkling water. And honestly, I don't drink my calories unless I really have to, like coffee or wine. But as far as like juices and stuff, I don't really drink mi calorías. So, and... Louisiana hot sauce for today. Going through my to-do list and things that I had to do today and I've crossed most of them off before I enter Nike, which is pretty good. I have my daily TikTok that I vlog today, which is kind of like increments of the whole day today on this vlog. Um, I have to fix my printer, send out some joggers, edit YouTube, thumbnail, wax appointment, did that. I think I did everything on here. So, so far so good. It's been a productive day and if you don't already write down your days, um, I definitely recommend that. Okay, gotta vlog it, sorry. Wait, okay, is it going? Yes. Alright, heading to Trabajo. Trabajo, this is what I'm wearing. Oh. <laughs> oh. Okay. And then you run. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, hello. Hello. Right now? <laughs> Hello. How are you? It's still going? Yeah. Oh. You can turn it off. It's enough for the vlog. <laughs> I'm not working. You know? That's it. That's all. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> you see the fit? No. Oh. What's up guys? So um, I just got back from work and then I went to the store with my friend Lily and it's currently 10.51. Went for small pick-me-ups at the store. It's pick-me-up, small, small grocery haul I guess you could say. And I just wanted to show you real quick. So for tonight's dinner, um, don't really have anything meal prepped so I went ahead and bought this spinach ricotta. It looks really, really good. For one serving, it has nine grams of protein, 
and 220 calories and for the whole package it's 26 grams of protein and 610 calories I'm not sure how much I'm gonna eat maybe the whole thing probably strawberries and blueberries for my oatmeal because oatmeal is my go-to in the mornings and I had a restock it's the organic quick oats um, and then my cravings I went ahead and got these fruit loop pop tarts I've never tried them before so I really wanted to and then I've never had this cereal either oatmeal cream pies cereal so there's that and then also don't go to the store when you're hungry because you get stuff like that <laughs> but overall I think I did good and then I have pure pineapple juice and pure cranberry juice so this is like pretty um, 100% and you always want to check the ingredients and then see how much added sugar there is for here there is no added sugar but it does have its natural sugar so yeah if you know what this combo is good for you know um but yeah with apple cider vinegar and honey if you know you know okay but um and it's super yummy too though i'm just boiling my water and i'm gonna have this so yeah that's pretty much gonna conclude the vlog thanks so much for watching thank you so much for watching give it a thumbs up if you like this type of vlogs, let me know. Comment down below, please, and I'll catch you in the next one.